Hey guys, I bet you're wondering how does this apply to you because you know copyright is not something that you think you're infringing on at any point in time. But I think the most important thing to start learning about is um, using fair use images in our presentations and the things that we're doing. Um, raise your hand if you know that you've just copied an, an image off the internet and used it for a project or a report or a post or anything like that. Yep. I know I have too, but there's something that you can do when you do Google searches to find out which artists and photographers have actually allowed you to use their images and have said, hey, you know what, go for it. Um, so when you're going into Google, there's a way that you can click images to make an image search. And what we're going to search first is I'm going to search Mickey Mouse. Because if you read the article about Disney, they are very particular about people using their um, images. In fact, a daycare once uh, made a mural with Disney images on it, and they made them take it down um, and paint over it. So when we first look at Mickey Mouse, we see that there are tons and tons and tons of images that are here that you could copy and paste. But we don't know if Disney's given or the artists have given um, us license to do that. So what we're going to look at now is more, sorry, settings, and go into an advanced search. Um, so we see that we're looking for um, Mickey Mouse, any size, and we want to look at usage rights, all right? And so these ones are not filtered by any license. So just any any images on the internet of Mickey Mouse are, can be found here. But we can search here, and it says free to use or share. So this means that the artists of um, the creators of those images has said, you know what, you can use these images here. Um, free to use or share, even commercially, that means that you're using them um, for a means that's gonna you know, get you some money. Um, also, these ones say here that free to um, use, share, or modify. So you can take that image and change it in some way. So we're just gonna look for things that are free to use or share, because usually in our, um, in our projects, we're just using them um, to show and click on advanced search. And I want you to notice here that we have a, f a lot fewer um, images for Mickey Mouse, and a lot of them are much more homemade as we're looking here, or they're pictures of things. Um, we have a much fewer um, choices to go with if we're looking for an image in Mickey Mouse here as we go through. Um, so as you're looking for images in the image search practice, I want you to practice finding the advanced settings. Again, clicking on settings, going to an advanced search, and adjusting the usage rights part there and search for some things, um, see how that impacts. You're also gonna learn how to use the Explore tool to also find things that have been um, licensed for fair use. All right, thanks so much.